uh, well, more and more each one, yeah. Um, can you just tell us a little bit maybe about literature in the 17th, 18th century, and particularly the production of the Bible, which was quite an important development, wasn't it, in, in, for Manx Gaelic? Well, yeah, that was the most important thing, really, and it's still obviously the biggest run of literature in Manx we've got, although new literacy, literacy is being produced now. And it had the same, well, of course, um, not like the same effect as in Wales, where the Bible in Wales had an enormous effect there and really um, made a lot of people literate. It didn't do that here, but it was a great revelation to have the Bible in Manx. And, of course, um, people like myself, who's not a real expert in this area, are always surprised to hear that there was a fairly efficient team assembled to um, translate the Bible into Manx. And these were um, generally native speakers of Manx. I think they all were. I'm not sure about this. But they were very good scholars. Um, some of them had studied... Um, even study Hebrew, I think, but certainly studied, studied Greek. And, uh, but in fact, they stuck to the King James D uh, Bible fairly rigidly, and that's quite evident. If you look at the King, J King James Bible in English, look at the Manx translation, they're pretty close. Um, and uh, this was a huge development, of course. And there's, there are stories about, um, I think, well, one about an old woman shouting out, I have now seen the light when, <laughs> when they... Um, she couldn't read or write in English or on Manx, but um, when, when the Bible was produced and, and people started reading from it in church services. Mm -hmm. But the literature was 99% um, um, religious, um, with stuff always in like, uh, repent ye miserable sinners and so on, <laughs> but, um, <laughs> which is sort of uh, gets a bit wearing after, after a time. But um, it was the only literature they had really written down. Uh, because um, I think at the time of a couple of hundred years it would have been a sign of a sin itself to show that you were so proud to write down your own thoughts. Those yeah. are my thoughts anyway. Yeah. Good my reach one yeah. My little Well more of my reach one yeah. Can I do just inch out begging McCann and Bible as Scansh and Bible the the Namanini is the Gilgaren. Well T uh force Fifi Scansh or the Fairwell and Guild uh on Ach um Hanel Nish Hoos the Bolo Fitakusha, Hanel Nish Hanel Leden Fisher Metakusha, the Kuri Indus Autumn is going out as Hoggy Indus of Slyella, then Mach, then our skimmy Inzit Kurat Rachelia, Chagla Trachelia, the Hurgild Vananach Erevival, as Scollier and Sly Krawi Sagatan Kurat Rachelia, Lorty Dugazach and Guild Manani. As for the Sunday Trachelia, the whole Gil got a Bible for it. The Tishan J, Jint Hannah, Ach, Vanaba Vua Jint Lurgshen, as for Chinny Hanella, a Kurgin Slyshen, the Danielo Studeris, a Unish for the Gisja, Nelmi Shiger, as San Shigeris, the Q Svegja, and Yenu Studeris, a Gregish, Ach, Mutta Jikan at a Bible, Spachtel, the Renet Gobracher. Leshen Weibel and Spurl, the Jint for Fulhera and Re Jamus, as the Shen and Lagan when it's in the image, as a Harau let letter for be on a limage in Stu Crowley, as an Lent on Jew, Sidon and Crawler, er in letter of Shen, son of Hood Smooth, get a Velshin Krug letter of Nolnish, as take a chit of a beg and dree the bay lie the Kinjach. They can Peggy Fry had a tray. Ach mi ai shen azulla te ram stuurigidn unsa gramadus unsa vibel as unsa stuurigidn. Yeah. Well, gura mai morid rishwanya. Mai daliwe.